talking, Sock. You done? You good? Um, have you calmed down now? What? Yeah, I'm good. Who would be scared of a talking sock? That's ridiculous. Yeah, okay. So, can we have a civilized conversation? And not scream then? <laughs> just, just give me a second. <sighs> just give me a second to get my breath back. Right. Look, so, yeah, I'm an odd sock. I'll admit it. Yeah. Odd being the dominant word there. You're a talking sock. That's really odd. Where I come from, all socks talk. And I'd like to say all socks are just like me, but that's far from true. A sock that isn't in a pair is a crime. So that makes me an outcast among my sock kind. I'm not like them. I, uh, I didn't fight my pair. Uh. I came through the void, isolated, entirely within that there washing machine. I'm on one last great search for my other half. I'm a wanted fugitive back in my world. But maybe if I can just find my other... Is this it? What? Is this a pairing at first sight? I'm sorry, what? You lost me. It's you! It must be you! The void has brought us together. I think... I think you might be my other half. You might be some strange, squishy, goblin-like creature, but I truly believe the Void brought us together for a reason. Together we can be a pair. It might not be a perfect pair, but I'm willing to look past your strange appearance. My? My strange appearance? You're a sock. You know, we could be a great pair. But, I think, I think it might be too late for us. Oh, thank goodness for that. Alas, we can never be. For I, I am a sock on the run from my own kind. They will never approve of such a pairing and they will come for me. Hey, wait a minute. Is it you lot that keep taking my socks? Is that where they keep going? Oh, I think... I think that's how my kind are born. Through the void. Through the great void of unknown. Do you know how many socks I go through? It's a lot. I mean, they're not hard to replace, but... It's really annoying. Haven't you ever noticed the great void swirling at the bottom of your washing machine? What's all this void nonsense? I've had this machine for weeks. I haven't noticed any void. Look again. Yep. All right. Let's have a look at this magical void then. All I see is a cheap green screen. What's a green screen doing in there? Oh, yeah, I don't think we have the budget for the void. 
Can I get you to do us a solid favor and just do that again, but use the power of imagination? Oh, okay. Wow. Look at that. Look at those effects. It's a big magical void. Yep, that's it. Yeah, wow. Just look at it. Swirling away at the bottom of my washing machine. Definitely no cheap green screen in there. Oh, it's such an amazing looking void. That looks like it was expensive. Do you, do you think this would void the warranty? Huh? What? What? I don't know. Oh, sock. That was a joke. This thing doesn't have a warranty. I got it secondhand at a garage sale. Garage sale? But that's a washing machine, not a garage. Strange name for a place you buy something that isn't a garage. Silence, human! Mm, um, can't you hear that? You know what? Human is not my name. You know that, right? I mean, I have an actual name. An actual human name. It's David. Alright? My name is David. Oh! And you think my name is Sock? It's Suckman, so you're close. Oh no! They found me! Uh, who found you? My kind! The other socks! Can't you hear them? It's the socks! Quickly! We must close the portal! We must close the void! What? How? Quickly! We must Hurry! They are coming! We must stop them from entering this world! I don't have a degree in portal science. I have no idea how to close this void. I don't know how this works. I'm an IT graduate for Pete's sake. Oh, David, stop bragging about your IT degree. It's powered through the washing machine, so all we have to do is turn that off. Just turn it off and you'll cut the tether to my world. So I just have to turn the washing machine off? The washing machine is generating the portal. Just turn it off! But Sock, Sockman, won't that... won't that be killing them? Oh no! They're going to come through! I can see... I can hear them! Quickly! We must do this! Do it now! Do it now! Do it now! The portal must be closed. If the tether is cut, then the life essence from my world will leave their body. Oh, okay, I get it. So doing this doesn't make me a bad person. Just do it! Do it now! Okay, don't rush me. It, uh, really sounds like they're suffering. <coughs> it's okay. They will die soon. <coughs> oh, jeez, Sock. That's really dark. You didn't even beat around the bush there. You know what? I can see now why society would frown upon human Sock relations. <coughs> you ever! Don't ever let society judge you for the life you choose to live! I made that mistake and look where it got me! <coughs> but you're doing okay, Sock. I mean, you're free now, right? You're free! <coughs> no, I'm dying! Dead because you killed me. You broke the tether to my world, the tether to my life essence, and now my life essence is leaving me. This is dying. I'm dead because you killed me. <coughs> 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 
you're not dead. You still have time. No! No! I was a slave to my society, and in many ways, you have set me free. I'm no longer a conformist slave. I'm free now, and I do thank you for that. And also... <coughs> I'm so sorry, Sock. But I really need to get this washing done. Mm -hmm. 